Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to install the Unreal Engine 4.27 in your computer, in your Windows 10. And now you can see, I already have the Epic Game Launcher and I already have the Unreal Engine 4.27.2. And now everything is ready. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you the official step-by-step -step how to get the Unreal Engine 4.27.2 Now, I'm going to show you how to install the Unreal Engine from the Epic's official website Open your browser This is a Google Chrome browser and I'm going to search it at here Download Unreal Engine So the first link, it shows you already Download the Unreal Engine and then, for me, I'm going to choose the publishing license. Click download now. And then you can see now it is downloading the Epic's installer. Just click start download and wait for a while until it finished download. Right, now it already finished download. This is an installer to install the Epic installer. This is the Unreal Engine. Just click open or you can find it inside your download folder here just right click the file explorer enter your download folder all right this is the download folder it is already downloaded it is here the epic installer now i already ex i already activated it just need to click install and click yes now it is installing you have to wait for a while for for this time, I will close my browser. Now, it is automatically install the DirectX. Now, for this time, you have to wait for a while. So, once it already finished install, it will automatically start the Epic Game Launcher. Now it is verifying the updates and now it is downloading the updates. You have to wait until it finished downloaded. It is about 500 MBs here. And once it finished, it will install the pre-required sites and then it will automatically launch. And here you have to wait for a while and just have a check. The Epic Game Launcher already pop out so in this moment you have to sign in in order to sign in for me I will sign in with Google it is up to you you can sign in with your Facebook or any other platform I will sign in with my Google it automatically will choose the browser the default browser and this browser I already signed in by using my Google account so it automatic sign in for me please continue to close this window and go back to the epic game launcher I continue in my epic game launcher here preparing the epic game launcher here I have to wait for a while now it is still loading just be patient now this is the first time choose the install location this is the default directory and this is another game that I already have so I may just want to skip this installation just click cancel and now I'm going to download the Unreal Engine you can see the Unreal Engine is here then I'm going to install the engine Unreal Engine 5 is available in preview but the official Unreal Engine now is up to 4.27 I go to the library, I try to download I click install a new version of the Unreal Engine Now this is the Unreal Engine 4.27.2 Okay, so of course I can just click install and at this moment just wait for a while Now, you have to choose and installation locations. This is the default location. C program file, Epic Games, 
UE 4.27. I will click, click install and create a shortcut on my desktop. I click install. Now it is downloading. You have to wait until it finish install. This is about 10 GB to 40 GB. It is initializing. And now you have to wait until it finish install. 13.6 GB so here you have to wait now after a few minutes you can see the Unreal Engine 4.27.2 already finished install and you also can see that there's a desktop shortcut at here of course you can find the directory here right click there properties and you can just click open file location okay now this is the one the UE4 editor it is at here and now the next step to set it up properly you can just go to the graphics setting and then here you can just browse you copy this destination location control c to copy and click here control v to paste and press enter now you double click the ue4 editor this is to select the default graphic card the default gpu for your unreal engine 4.27 click the options if you have two gpu you have to choose the most powerful gpu in that computer choose the high performance and click save and now done, close. Next time, when you want to launch your Unreal Engine 4.27, you can just double click the desktop shortcut, or you can just right click here, pin to, pin to taskbar, and it will always here when you click it, it is going to launch the Unreal Engine 4.27. If this is the first time you open, you have to click allow access. And wait for a while now it is launching the unreal engine 4.27.2 and here just wait for a while to make sure you can run properly now you can see one more time this is just a one-time click you click allow access everything will be okay so now as demo i will just start a new game project the third person game next and here i will just name it as first the test 4.27.2 create the project just have a test see whether it can function properly or cannot all right just have a look So now this is the game project, see everything run normal, when you try to test play, it is okay, everything run very smooth, and there's nothing, everything worked correctly. Alright, that's all for today about how to install the Unreal Engine 4.27, and that's all for today, thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy animation and game developing! See you!